Now, like Elmo Teenager will be a different kind of Olympian this summer. He's been selected to compete in the World Championships of Physics for high school students. Our Maury Glover has his story. Why stuff happens, why, how, why reality works the way it does. Evan Erickson has always had a knack for solving scientific problems, like using a laser to measure the width of a human hair. The hair is 65 centimeters from that wall. Now he's taking his talent for physics to the world stage. It is uh, very exciting. I was uh, very elated uh, when I, I got the news. It's a, a huge honor. The high school senior is one of the top mathletes in the state, placing fifth in the Minnesota High School Math League this year. But he's also one of five students from across the country to make the U.S. physics team which will compete at the International Physics Olympiad later this month, where they will finish two five-hour experimental and theoretical tests on everything from electricity and magnets to relativity. It includes stuff like mechanics, like things moving and making them move, why they move, like rotation, like springs and gravity, like, like Newton's laws, like that, that kind of stuff. Erickson is no stranger to overachieving. He got a perfect ACT score when he was in the ninth grade. He and a friend even started a free online math camp to help middle school students with subjects like algebra and geometry over the summer. Using talents and abilities to help others is uh, very important. So that was, that was a way that I could help others learn and love math. 3.6 centimeters for six. Because of COVID precautions, Erickson will take part in the Olympiad from here in Minnesota instead of traveling to Lithuania. The width of the hair is approximately 69 uh, micrometers. But he hopes his love of physics will add up to a win. It's a huge opportunity, and I'm, I'm excited that I have the honor of doing it. In Lake Elmo, Maury Glover, Fox 9. Hmm. And we're excited wow. to have him represent Minnesota. That's fantastic. Happy Good years. luck. Good for him.